Well, many students from American University will be among the millions of voters who cast their ballots at the polls today, and that's thanks in part to a single tweet from one student of that university who in September posted this. I'm calling on American U to cancel classes on election day and allow students to vote in person and work the polls. That single tweet set off a movement that eventually led to the school's change in policy. Tamir Harper, who started that effort to lobby his school for the day off, joins us now. Tamir, I'm pretty sure you're the most popular <laughs> student there at American University. Uh, so you're working the polls, I hear. You're not taking this day off of this historic election day. You're right in the heart of democracy in action. How does it feel? It's exciting. I'm here in Philadelphia um, and going up and down this city uh, with Nina Ahmad, a candidate for Auditor General. Um, who is going to make history, hopefully, as the first woman of color um, to hold executive office in the Commonwealth. Well, Tamir, it, I'm sure when you sent that tweet out, you thought, OK, I'll get some support. People will, will you know, retweet it. But did you actually expect this outcome, that the university would change its policy and close on Election Day? I was not expecting it. And after uh, the tweet went out, actually, one of my professors emailed me and was like, well, I've been calling on AU to do this for so long. Hopefully, it's a success this year. And what was reaction when the other students and teachers found out that the school would actually close for voting? So much excitement, honestly. I was actually preparing to teach um, a class, and a lot of people were texting, good job, we are excited about this. Um, and I finally opened my email and seen our a notification that the president was going to be allowing uh, students and staff off on election day. So people were so excited um, and staff actually commented on their Instagram post saying that they're going to go work um, election day at their local polling location. Well, I mean, that's got to be an amazing feeling to know that you have uh, you know, exacted so much change. And you know that students from other schools also tried to do the same thing you did and unfortunately were unsuccessful in lobbying their schools to be closed today. So I want to know what you would say to those students who tried but didn't get the results that you did. Keep mobilizing. Keep doing it. Keep calling them out. Um, and very soon, I'm excited after this election cycle to actually be building a coalition of students to do this work and get universities to call off and organize young people to be active um, in election cycles. Tamir Harper there, change with just one tweet. Good job there. Um, and thanks for being an inspiration, working the polls today. It's not a day off for you. So uh, congratulations on what you did and enjoy your day at the polls there. Thank you all. Be safe. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.